Welcome everyone, this is Master's Joke. Also, Master's Joke 75 on Instagram. So I can't believe I've now come to the uh, end of Wave 2 of Return of the Jedi, the retro collection. So today is the last figure, Wicket the Ewok. Now I, I think he looks, um, I, th I think the figure looks so much like he did back in the day. But I, um, I did, uh, if you watched my previous um, Admiral Akbar video, you would have seen that I found my original. So there's, there's, there's no accessories, but this is the little guy that I would have been playing with back in um, like 1984-85. Well, probably a lot longer than that. So he's very, he's very, um, you know, he's, he's, he's very played with. But I used to love, I love this little guy. I, I, I do want, I do want to get some accessories at some point. Uh, I don't mind. I, I, I'm not fussed about repros at all, because it just means that your figure, um, you know, has another, another chance of life. So yeah, I will. I, de I definitely will try and pick up some uh, repros for this little guy. But um, yeah, it's great to have him. It's great to have him, and it's great to have this. Uh, this retro collection figure. Now I've had a I've had a little look at the actual uh, figure itself. Now the bubble is absolutely perfect. The you know it's still not the thick the thick card, but it's a it's a lovely it's a lovely example. You know if you wanted to keep this on card. And um, and the other thing is he's got both his ears. So I don't, I don't see any, like I'm over it. I don't see any defects at all. So he, he looks really, really good. I mean, there's not a lot that could go wrong with Wicket, let's be honest. But he looks really, really good. I mean, I've shown this many times, the normal rubbish on the back. I really hope one day that um, Hasbro will do something with the back of the uh, the cards. Even, even if it was just a little bit of, you know, old photos of the original figures or something. You know they they need someone who's got passion for the uh, for the retro collection line, working with them. You know they they need someone. There's got to be someone out there who's got a toy experience who could uh, you know who could help them with this. But oh, I absolutely love it. Really looking forward to getting them open. A little bit I'm a little bit sad that I've uh, I've only got one more retro collection figure to open. But as I mentioned on on my previous video. Hasbro have sent me an email to say that my uh, um, was it Wave Two of A New Hope with the uh, vac metalized R two D two and C three PO should be with me by the end of the month. And I'm, I'm I mean the thing is, I I got a second chance to order it, so it's you know it's already out there on YouTube. So I doubt many people will watch me opening them up, but I, I can't wait. I, I'm <laughs> I'm especially excited to. Uh, open up R2-D2 and C-3PO because I just love those guys but um, all the figures are great and I want to do a comparison I just think it's I just think it's an interesting thing to do so let's get um, Ewok open so I'll put my original who who I would never get rid of not in a million years he would have come from Tesco's Edmonton Green as well so let's put him out of the way and let's get Ewok open or Wicket the Ewok open, or Wicket W Warwick open. I don't ever remember him being called Wicket W Warwick. I know he was on the original um, Kenneth figure, but I don't remember that. I don't really remember much about the card backs, to be honest, because I just opened them like it was uh, Christmas 1984. So there he is, and I've already lost his, uh, his spear. <laughs> so yeah, definitely like it was back in the day. But he looks really, really good. He, yeah, he really does. He, 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 the actual definition looks good, but obviously I need to compare it first. So let's get him out of the packet. Let's find his spear from the floor. And let's compare him with the original wicket. So here he is. And I think he looks really, really nice. He's got a nice weight to him as well. Um, yeah. As I said, it's got lovely definition on there, so it'll be interesting to check uh, or compare the definition to my original. I'm gonna, uh, gonna take off his little his little headpiece. 
yeah, that, that is one good looking teddy bear. I really like it. And he's got all the Hasbro stuff on the back there, just so you know. Uh, just so, so just so you know, you're buying a fake. <laughs> if ever you see one of these at a toy fair in in years to come. So let's just get his brother just to compare them. And here they are together. So um, he's a uh, well. I mean, one thing I noticed is his eyes look slightly smaller, but that's probably just to do with the paint application. Um, yeah, there, there's the definition looks really good on the new Wicket, and it is it, it's not as defined as the original, but it does look really good. Um, the brown the brown looks spot on in relation to the um, in relation to the the colouring of the plastic and the actual paint application on his face and uh, his face and, and stomach area and his ears just looks great. Really, they've really done a great job on this. Let's have a look at his, uh, his legs there. Yeah, so the holes, the holes are in slightly a different place, which is, which is interesting. Um, but yeah, I'm really pleased with this. I think they've done a really, really good job on him. Yeah, another 10 out of 10 figure, 100%, 10 out of 10. So let's have a look at his um, his spear, just to check the quality. And there's his spear. Looks really, really good. And also, it's flexible, but it's not cheap plastic. It's a nice, solid piece, like the majority of the retro collection um, accessories that I've seen. And I mean, I've got every single retro collection figure, so yeah, this is really good. They've done a really, really good job. They just need to sort those card backs out, just to make them a little bit more interesting. Really, really nice. So let me just uh, set him up. Right, Wicket does look pretty awesome with his spear. They've they've done a really, really good job. I'm, I'm honestly, I'm really impressed by this. I mean, there were, you know, we have to be honest, it's a, it's, a, it's a little guy. There wasn't really a lot that could go wrong. But I, I think they're spot on with it. I really, really like it. It's a shame I don't have the original spear and the original headpiece to kind of do a, do a proper comparison. But I'm well happy. 10 out of 10. Any day of the week. This whole set is highly recommended. And the spear... And, I, and I, you know, and, and the thing is, right, I mean, Hasbro have made a lot of issues with uh, Star Wars, but you know, credit where credit is due. The majority of the retro collection figures are perfect. So I've, you know, put, put Yak Face and the Emperor's Wall Guard to one side. I, I love this line so much. And that spear and, and the, the accessories and the weapons. And I, 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 I'm trying to think, I, I think the only weapon I'd have to I'd have to go back and check them, but I think the only weapon I had an issue with was was Cara Dunes. I don't think any other retro weapon has had it has, has had any issues, apart from Wave One of the retro collection where the figures couldn't hold their weapons. You know, but you know they they were they were the early days of the retro collection, and and um, I think I think Hasbro will get there. I think they will get there one day. Not quite yet. But they will get there. But he looks great. But before I um, before I end the video, I've got to uh, I've got to at least um, set up my original wicket with uh, the retro collection headpiece and spear just for old times. And there's my original wicket, just like he was back in the eighties. Looks amazing. This whole set is. Fantastic, highly recommended. I'm sure Hasbro Pulse will re-release it, so you know, keep checking their uh, keep checking their website. Um, re I've really enjoyed this. Also, want to um, thank everyone for uh, for all their support um, over the last few weeks. It's, it's it's been amazing, and all the comments. And I will get uh, back to everybody. I'll answer everyone's comments. Um, hoping to do, to do it um, 
I'm going to try start it, start, to start doing it at weekends because I'm getting so many at the moment. But anyway, that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. It also helps the channel. And I'll see you in the next one.